in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for the trials that come my way. In that way I can grow each day as I let you for our good night message on this Wednesday, the 7th of October 2020, broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Rome, Italy, by your servant Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco. We listen to this encouraging message in form of a poem in line with the gospel passage of today and the memorial we celebrated of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary entitled, Lord, Teach us to pray. And let our spirits take control of all I do. Cause when those trials come, my human nature shows a thing to do. And God's offspring can be easily. Today we celebrated the memorial of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. And the essence of this memorial is found in Luke chapter 1 verse 14, where we are told, All these with one accord devoted themselves to prayer, together with the women, and Mary, the mother of Jesus, was with them. Mary, the mother of Jesus, continues to be with us every time we confidently pray. Every time we submit ourselves in prayer, she continues being with us because she was with them after the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ. And she continues to be with us every time we say, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Pray for us. And she is that companion. She is that mother who continues interceding for us in our times of trouble. The disciples in the gospel passage of today, taken from Luke chapter 11 verse 1 to 4, find Jesus at prayer. And they request him to teach them to pray as John taught his disciples. This is our request today. We are telling him, Lord, teach us to pray. When our hopes fade and our dreams die, when we find no answers to problems we face because we don't know your plans upon our shaky lives, teach us to pray, Lord. when our faith seems shaken from the comfort it enjoyed because we had no trouble then, teach us to pray that we may learn to understand that even in the trials of life you are there, that even in those tempests whose source and purpose we do not fathom, you are there. Teach us to pray, Lord. When we are broken by life trials and weary from life's defeats, teach us to pray, Lord. When we feel badly battered and have no joy or peace in our lives, teach us to pray, Lord, that we may understand through all these things that you are at work and you are the best mender we can ever think of when it comes to our brokenness. When, like one of our daily bread members in Kenya, we lose a spouse through an accident that would have claimed both lives, but we survive and come to realize there is nothing left to sustain our hope and reason for existence. Teach us to pray, Lord, 
that even in such a case we may understand you spared us for a purpose when life seems unfair and we have more than we can take teach us to pray lord so that we can learn through this that your ways are not our ways and our ways are not yours either help us to understand that you see our struggles and that you even know the bends ahead of our journey that we are going to negotiate with your help teach us to pray even in our excitements of life when all is well and blessings overflow when we are all smiles because things are smooth teach us to pray that we may never forget you in our high moments but that we may remember you are the god of the mountains as well as of the valleys teach us to pray lord glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen the lord be with you and with your spirit and may almighty god bless you the father the son and the holy spirit amen good night as it dreams same to you father